What's up, peeps? Welcome back to the Lionel Beast Show. It's your first time tuning into the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the videos, man. Also, make sure y'all click that notification bell button so anytime I drop a brand new video, y'all be the first ones to get it. Now, peeps, it look like Kirk Franklin is somewhere right now hitting the stump as his son that messed up the church's money is now sitting his ass in jail. No, it wasn't for digging his manicure hands in the collection plate. It's allegedly for the death of a woman in Texas, and he's currently being questioned for it. Now, more on this. You are now tuned into YouTube's favorite, Lionel B. The Lion B Show. get this video popped off man I want to make sure y'all head over to INeedMyCoins.com y'all we have people over there making $500 a day and more I personally been in it like I told y'all on my last video man I already made over a thousand dollars man in like a week and a half on this program this program is super legit man it's making millionaires every single day I personally man I'm gonna have about eight million dollars sitting in my account man by Christmas guaranteed man this program is super lit is so many people in here getting that bag every day. All y'all gotta do is click on that link. There is Zoom meetings every single day and also the website has all the information you need as well as how to make your first investment. So man, if you are sleeping on this opportunity, something wrong with you. So make sure y'all go ahead and click on INeedMyCoins.com right now, get signed up, finish watching this video. Now y'all know man, Carrion Franklin is no stranger to drama. As he recently appeared on the Zeus's new reality show entitled Bad Boys. Now recently, Carry On Franklin just came out as bi. And also, man, he's actually making some headlines, but unfortunately not for the right reason. So apparently, man, after his outburst and some leaked episodes of their show, now all of a sudden, man, he recently got arrested um, while driving the vehicle of a woman who was allegedly found dead, y'all. Now, this thing here is absolutely crazy. Now, according to Larry Reed Live, he was arrested while driving in California after a Beverly Hills police officer stopped him for a broken car tail light. Now, when the cops searched the car, they discovered an illegal pistol. Now, this is where it actually gets really insane because after discovering the weapon, that's when the police took him in for questioning. And actually, Franklin says the pistol did not belong to him. It was also discovered that the car he was driving didn't belong to him either. Now, but to a missing woman who is rumored to be dead now. Apparently right now, y'all, Carry On Franklin has now been charged with three felonies and is being held in Texas currently right now. So y'all want to play this little clip, man, so y'all can hear what Larry Reed Live had to say. He does have a personal connection with Carry On, so I'm going to let y'all hear what he has to say. Man, this stuff here is crazy. We can't make this up. And so he called me to damn. And he was telling me that he had been arrested and he's been locked in jail. He said he was wrongfully arrested. Now, this is what he told me. He told me that he was wrongfully arrested and he was stopped because of his tail line. So when they did that, he said that they were they're putting other charges. This is what he said, that they're putting other charges on him. And now they have locked them up and something about he can't get after Tuesday. So it was a very quick phone call, and I said, calm down, carry on until we can get you out. And so but when I began to look into getting him out, I began to run into some other things. When I looked, they arrested him because of some charges in Texas. And the charges in Texas, there's no bond for them. But as they begin to deal with Carry On, now you watch Bad Boy Club, so you know how that can go. And you also have heard the audio between him and his dad. You know both of them pop off it. And so in that exchange, there was an altercation with the cops. They're now calling it resisting arrest. So that's another charge. And then they begin to search his car. Stop for the 
tail light, allegedly, but I got to tell you something else that I'm finding out with that. And they searched the car and then they found a gun, allegedly. Now, Carry On told me on the phone that they're trying to slap two other charges on, on him just because and that the charges were not true. So Carry On is saying he did not, if I take the one he said, he did not resist arrest and that there was no gun that they found that was his. So I'm assuming that he's alleging that the gun was planted. So then I found out that there basically was no way for us to really get him, at least not right now, I haven't discovered one because they have to extradite him to Texas. Someone calls calls me because of my post. So then they begin to tell me how he had been questioned for a murder. So now wait a minute, 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 a murder. So the first thing I thought about was CJ. Because see, carry on and CJ, he was upset because of the accusation that he was alleging that carry on was making against his father that was so hideous that I will not even repeat on this platform. And then he does up and dead. So I'm like, wait a minute, let me call here, let me call them, let me call them. And so it's not about his death because that was an overdose. So Carry On was being questioned about another murder of a female. And I said, okay, well, what would, I mean, he told me that the brake light, whatever, was out, and that's why they stopped him. They said, mm, that may not be the reason why they stopped him because he's driving the car of the murdered victim. There you have it, peeps. Definitely a crazy situation with Carry On Franklin, man. Definitely making his dad look even worse. Now, apparently, man, I think they're going to be having some fish fries to get up his bail money. Nah, I'm just playing with y'all. Nah, y'all, but yeah, it's definitely a sad situation, man, that he is connected to something that has to do with the passing of a young lady. So definitely a while. Definitely wild, y'all. So y'all let me know how y'all feel about this, man. How do y'all feel about Carry On, man? Is he toxic or is he just, you know, a celebrity kid that's just out there wrong like, you know what I'm saying, Jaden Smith? Like, y'all let me know how y'all feel about this, man. Make sure y'all do not forget to hit the link on INeedMyCoins.com. Y'all go ahead and get signed up. Tell y'all go ahead and get to this bag, man. Money is crazy, y'all. The money is absolutely crazy. Like, you know what I'm saying? If y'all want to be a part of this program, man, make sure y'all go ahead and pull up, man. I'm telling y'all, man, come and get these bands. This is not no game. And I'm going to peep y'all on the next one. Holla.